all the good men. <laughs> this is what women are asking around here all the time. It's like, where are they? We want to have a partner, boyfriend. We want to have babies with men, but they are not here. Where are they? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's, shocking. it's a question that really a shocking. lot of people ask, a lot of women ask. Why is this question in the air? I think there's a really, really, really deeply embedded program in our consciousness. I'll speak maybe for women. Yeah, tell me more. That says there aren't any good men around. Mm -hmm. That men can't meet me. That... Um, that men are this and that they're like that they're lower, <laughs> the lower species. <laughs> oh, that's shocking. Um, yeah, there's something, I mean, check in with, if you're a woman watching this, just check in with yourself and see, do you ever kind of buy into that story or that programming that there aren't any good men around or there aren't any men who are going to meet me? Mm. And if you do, if you think those thoughts or have that type of feeling, then what that means is you're buying into a belief system that says there aren't any good men. And that belief system is then going to inform your reality mm. and you're going to feel like there aren't any good men around. So yeah, it's really, really important to check in and see what stories are you buying into. Because the truth is, there are beautiful men. Of course. Everywhere. Every I've, single man in my tribe is like beautiful, gorgeous, yeah, you know, and, really uh, and ready to show up. Yeah, they're beautiful men. Um, do you have anything? I want to say something else, but I want to hear what you Yeah, for me, the, the, the core idea that we, when, you, when we say something like, where are the good men, is like already questioning the fact that they are out there. Yeah. And um, that's a pattern that I call gender discrimination, right? It's like, Women, we are ready, and men are not, and uh, that's not my experience at all. You know, I see very often women, women that I've been coaching, having uh, this calling for a guy, right? And then the guy shows up, and uh, he's he's got all the qualities, everything that this woman has been asking for. And instead of opening up, it's you know the the woman might be retracting in fears and in in patterns that are locking the energy from from opening up. So uh, you know, check internally: Are you relationship ready? Are you ready to you know to give up sometimes mm -hmm. some aspects of your freedom to engage into a couple into mm -hmm. a relationship? Are you ready to? To, to actually partner up really on the deep level mm. with making decisions together, with living together, you know, with all that stuff. And if there is fear around that, if there are fears, hesitations, or blocks around that, then check it, check it internally. Yes. And uh, one more thing that is important about that is like, when I ask women, you know, who, who are in that zone of questioning if there are any good men around, I say, do you love men? Do you love them? You know, do you love them? Do you adore them? Do you want them in your life? Do you want to be around them? And if most of the, the stories that you have around them are traumatic or negative or, you know, negative comments, negative feedback about what men do, how they behave, etc., then, uh, you know, the, the first thing to do is change your self-talk. You say, I love men. I want them in my life. Men are beautiful. They are ready to serve me. They are ready to partner yes. with me. And so, on. so yes. changing yes. that story is really important. Yes. Oh, yeah, I have a few more things. Yeah, to go ahead. Um, one of them that's coming up connected to what you're saying is also remember that you're going to call in people who treat you the way you treat yourself. So just, yeah, really mm. tune into am I honoring myself? Am I listening to myself? Am I showing up for myself? Am I doing all these things that I want a man to do with and for me? Because that's really important for you to have that energy already alive in your system and that's gonna call in someone who matches that. And the other thing I wanna say is, it's also really important for us to remember that we're all humans. And so we're all learning here. We're not perfect and a good man is not the same thing as someone who never triggers you <laughs> like those like a good man is going to trigger you like that's going to be part of it and we have to remember that we have there's such there's collective wounding in the feminine and the masculine and we're coming together to heal these wounds and part of the healing of these wounds is bringing them to the surface so so good men and good partners are going to evoke sometimes challenging 
feelings and energies inside of you. Mm. But that's part of it. It's part of the that's story. That's part of it. Exactly. And it's beautiful. And you, you open to that. Mm. I think a lot of times when we get triggered by someone or when we hit those places, we think this person isn't right for me. This isn't good. And sometimes that can be the case. But just stay open to the fact that we are imperfect. We're all learning here. We're all growing together. There are amazing men out there and they're still going to trigger you, but that's good because you're going to grow from that. So. Yeah. Beautiful. Yeah. Beautiful. Mm -hmm. um, the, uh, you know, the idea that a man has to be perfect to come into your field as well. Uh, yeah, is, uh, is, uh, a guy is not going to be perfect. He's going to be human. And yeah. so when you see him doing things that you go like, wow, I don't really like that. Maybe there is room for him to improve, to evolve, you know, give him some space to yes. actually be be human yes. and when you see him doing something that isn't perfect you go like wow it looks like he's a human being yeah. he's got stuff to to improve and 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 learn yes. and also the idea is not to disqualify men too fast you know mm -hmm. in a, like uh, what i see women do very often is like they, they see um, a quality that they don't like in a man and then it's going to be a disqualifier totally. straight away and so yeah i don't disqualify men because no, they're not perfect just right. give them a chance and, and yes. expand within that field Yes, yeah. everything you're saying. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. Yes. We love you. We hope that you find the right partner for you. Yeah, call the right them lover. In. Mm. Yeah, let's call them let's in. All, yeah, let's all partner up or meet the people who are going to help us grow and evolve. I think it's beautiful. Yeah, men are beautiful. Yes, they are. I'll see you soon. Bye.